Hey, my name is Mike, and this is a too long didn't read guide for the Atal Dazar dungeon. Priestess Alunza does Gilded Claws, which makes her melee attacks do more damage to the tank for 12 seconds. Dispel the Molten Gold Dot from whoever has it. Avoid the Golden Orbs. Kill the Ad as soon as it spawns, and it can be slowed or stunned if you want. Transfusion is cast at 100 energy, and it is a 5 second AoE that also heals her. Stand in a red puddle as she begins casting this to get a 15 second dot. Anyone with this dot will make her take damage instead of heal. Interrupt Noxious Stench on Volcal and don't stand in the green swirlies. Kill the three totems at the start of the fight at about the same time, or else still heal the full. Once they're gone, the boss will start to take damage. He'll also do more damage and begin to spawn green puddles underneath him, so kite him around the room. On Razan, don't stand in the purple puddles on the ground and try not to kite the boss over these either, as doing so will slow your movement speed and spawn adds. Serrated Teeth gives the tank an 8 second dot that also makes you take more damage. Hide around a pillar when terrifying visage is being cast. If you're in line of sight of this, you'll get feared. Razan will also choose a random person to pursuit. You can either run away and try to spawn as few adds as possible, or just get eaten and have the healer try to keep you alive. Interrupt racking pain on Yasma and avoid the purple swirlies and spiders. If you touch a spider, avoid the purple pools that they spawn. Skewer does a lot of damage on the tank. At 100 energy, the boss will do Soul Rend, which is an AoE. You have about 6 seconds to run to the opposite side of the room and ideally stack up. When the cast is finished, everyone will spawn an ad that needs to die before it touches the boss. These can be CC'd. Part of the damage your ad takes is done to you as well. The tank does not spawn an ad though, so they don't need to move. That was a too long didn't read guide for the Atal Dazar dungeon. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and consider following me on Twitter. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day!